Hello everyone and welcome back. In this video, I'll tell you guys how to install BP and ECG on your Samsung Galaxy Watch 5 and Watch 5 Pro. This method is fully working on a Samsung based phone, but you can try on a non Samsung phone as well. The process is kind of simple, so make sure you follow all these steps carefully. You can subscribe to the channel as I'll be posting more content like giveaways tricks related to Galaxy Watch 5 soon. Okay, first of all, we have to make some changes on our watch. Go to settings, scroll down and tap on about watch. Select software and tap multiple times on software version. Now developer mode has been turned on on your watch. Go back to settings and choose connections present here. Turn off Bluetooth and turn on Wi-Fi. Make sure it is connected to the same Wi-Fi network to which your phone is connected. Now go back and choose developer options. After that, scroll down. Here you will see ADB debugging. First enable that. Next enable debug over Wi-Fi. Once again go back to settings page and again tap on developer options. This time you will see an IP address in debug over Wi-Fi section. Just note it down. Next we have to download two files. Their link is down in the description. And once again thanks to Dante from XDF for his amazing work. These files will be updated here as well as on the website gadgetsinja.com. The first file is more Samsung health monitor that will work in any country without any restriction. Its link is also present down. After installing it, we have to download watch file which is about 12 megabyte in size. Next to install this file on your watch, you have to download Bug Jagger application from the Google Play Store. After installing Bug Jagger application, open it up. It will show this type of interface. You will see this plus icon on the top right side. Tap it and enter the IP address that you have noted down from watch. You will see a prompt message on your watch. Just tap on OK. Now your watch is connected to your phone via Wi-Fi. Next we have to install that watch file. For that, Make sure you are under packages section in bug jagger application. After that, tap on this plus icon at the top and choose that file that you have downloaded for watch. Make sure that this is the same file in your download folder. After some time, new SHM app will be installed on your watch. Now we have to make some last few changes on our watch. For that, go to settings and scroll down. Tap on developer options. Here turn off debug over Wi-Fi and ADB debugging. This step is important as not turning off ADB debugging will drain battery life of your watch. After that, go back to connections in settings and here you can turn on Bluetooth. Now you can open SHM app on your watch and follow on screen instructions. Calibrate the watch with a real cuff based BP apparatus. And also keep in mind that this BP reading is just for your personal information. Never use it to change medications and if you're not feeling well, just consult your doctor. So guys, that was all about for today's episode. If you have any questions, just drop them in the comment section and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, bye bye.